Hey up, Kirby Mercury here. Welcome to my let's play of 20XX. This is a Mega Man like game that's also roguelite. I haven't played it in quite some time. Just wanna go take a gander, see what is around. I'm sure they added a shit ton of things since I've played it last. They've added the difficulty thing, that, that's new to me. I'm just gonna go normal setting for now. But yeah, it's basically a procedurally generated Mega Man game with random pickups along the way. The levels, level layouts are usually different, kind of like Spelunky, but more Mega Man based. And I keep forgetting that I can actually Dodge. Okay, I forgot how, and then I remembered because I tried it out. So I guess I didn't waste too much HP screwing around there. I guess I don't have to dodge every time I jump, but I will anyway. Yeah, it's, it seems pretty easy. I've never really made it too far in the game of like probably three boss fights. I'm pretty sure the animation for the charge thing is different than what it was before. And here's kind of like a challenge area. I've never seen this one, but I know that those, oh God. Not, don't know what that is. Okay, I'm kind of just winging it. I made it. Glory achieved. Let's get some Grant's knockback. Okay, that's just the finish line, I guess. Yeah, I've seen that before where it's kind of like a mob trap room and you have to kill the enemies in the thing without getting hit or whatever. But I've never seen it actually be like a platforming puzzle before, which is kind of cool. And yeah, there's random pickups along the way so you can power up your run. Every time I pick this game up, there's always new stuff added into it because it's still in early access and they always have a counter to when the next update will be, which is really cool. Don't really need to screw with that right now. Let's just go see what the boss is like. There's probably a chance I've faced this guy before. Let's see if I recognize any of his attacks. So far, not ringing any bells. Yeah, that was great. Could have made it out of there alive. You know, the smart thing to do is stay close to him because I have a chance to get away from his freaking bullet spray. Doesn't help I don't have any damage upgrades. There we go. That's definitely a new explosion animation that I've never seen before. Don't know what this is. Phantom Might, basic attacks, deal more damage. It's fine by me. Um, okay. It's still kind of the same as before. Uh, take the nuts or the life extender. Let's go with the life. And the other thing is the power of the boss. Increase your speed, gotta go fast. The Sonic reference oh i didn't that's new as well i'm just gonna go to the first one because i don't really care since i have no strategy since yeah it's been a while i really do enjoy this game i'll tell you that i might have said that several times by now because i don't really play it too often that will 
that will show in due time if it if it already hasn't. Like I probably shouldn't have been firing shots at that guy's shield. Probably not the best strategy. Health, thank you. Tell power over here. Blast those nerd bats. Did not think that guy was gonna hit me because he was going like super slow motion. And what do we have here? Okay. Simple enough. I like, I really like how creative. Oh, Jesus, man. Oh, really? Creative they get with the platform puzzles. Even though it's procedurally generated, but they. There is sections that are. What is this? Sure, I'll pay money for HP. Probably use some. But yeah, you, I've never really came across a time where um, things were laid out in the way that it was impossible to get through. As far as I can remember. Son of a bitch. Can't quite make it there. Let's go check out what this is. It's health. That's what I need. Ah, oh, damn it. And teleportation. Another boss already. I guess stages aren't too long. That's good. I don't have the money for that. Let's go, go kick this guy in the face. Mr. Icy Avenger. Oh, jeez. It does feel kind of slow, like the movement speed. However, you should be uh, dashing a lot more than I am. Whoa. Kind of surprised I dodged that. To be honest, come on. Just pummel him. Watch that brand new shiny death animation. Get some more speed. Just what I needed. No, that's the wrong, wrong mascot. Um, let's see. I'm gonna just roll with basic upgrades for now. And if I come across any, um, come across any active upgrades, I'll grab them as I go. Try them out. I don't remember what button it is to use them. So there's that. But yeah, when I first played this game, I really could not get down with the art style of it. I guess it's so used to just plain old Mega Man. Stuck in my old, old man ways. It's good enough HP for now. Okay, well those platforms died. Oh yeah, forgot about those magnetic freaking things. Okay, stick there. Um, excuse me? Okay. I kind of thought I could pass through those. The armor's good. I don't think there was armor last time I played this. It is good. Whoa, you, are you serious? Okay, this is kind of weird platforming I'm not used to, but you get there. Get some nuts. Let's go see what this one has to offer. Try to get, give me that, that, that nut. Okay, wait, what? I didn't read the objective. Um. Oh. It just said touch the red things without getting hit probably. I got lost in my own rambling and fucked it all up. Okay, maybe it doesn't matter if I get hit. Glory achieved. 
Okay, that wasn't so hard since I had no idea what I was doing and I did it anyway. So now I have kind of a hover that's pretty decent. Seems like you can get pretty overpowered in this game if you have all the right pickups. God damn it. But there's also human error at at play. Might be a big part of this. Let's see if I can get up here. I can. It wasn't so hard. That hover might screw me up a little. I'm not gonna lie. Can't go that way because there's a thing blocking me. Okay, that guy's stuck. So I'll just leave him. Let him be. That's the... Oh, what is going on? Okay, I lied. That's the right way to go. Thought that thing was blocking me, but it was not. Only I'm only slightly embarrassed. Let's see, yeah. You know it's a Mega Man like game when well first of all the character looks a lot like Mega Man, but it's a girl. And the guy with the sword is a girl. I mean is a guy. It's like the opposite of Mega Man and Zero. And if you're a big Mega Man fan, I would be very surprised if you don't already have this game because, yeah, unless it didn't get enough. Let's go check what's in here. Enough coverage or anything. I guess this is like a shop. I already have that power up. Gives me better jumping abilities. I'll buy the health. More survivability is always good. And I have no idea how long the game is either. Cause yeah, like I said, I've only beaten like three bosses or something and then lost. This guy is kind of an asshole cause he hides away in his little freaking shell thing. But yeah, watch the hover boots actually screw me up more than they help me. I'm really not used to that. I should really re destroy these things. I didn't realize that, that was something I could be doing. God damn it. Okay, okay. Kill that flower. Didn't quite get anywhere. You stupid platform. Get out of here, flowers. Frickin' hover jump. Yeah, next time I see the hover jump, I might not pick it up. I mean, it's good for platforming purposes, but it just kind of screw me up a little. Also, they changed this boss, dude. From what it was last time. Sure, they made it a lot easier because I remember there was like. It was pretty much impossible to avoid getting hit at certain points. And I don't remember that layout, but I do remember the boss. You know, I've been getting a lot of. Um. No power yet. Okay. Yeah, I've been getting a lot of health upgrades, so I just wanted to pick that up this time so I can show off what those are like. Let's go with this dude. I was just gonna pick the first one, but whatever. I'll try this guy out. I mean, that's pretty decent. Oh, those rodent things are new. Okay, so they can be killed. I didn't think they could for a second there launch a freaking mortar at him. I'm at max HP. Things are going well. This would be the kind of 
game that you'd want to see. Whoa. Speedrunning competitions in, even though it's procedurally generated, but it still would be really cool because that way people can't Ooh, practice beforehand. Well, you still can, but can't practice the exact. God damn you! Exact level layout. Good thing there was health waiting there for me. So I'm pretty sure the health disappeared before, and now it kind of sticks around. Let's see what this one is. I'll read it this time. Don't get caught. Oh no. I think we can handle this. I took a little bit of damage, that's fine. Took more damage, that's fine. More damage. Avoid that shit. We're good, we're golden. Core legs, four way dash. What? Okay, wait, what? Oh, what? Four way dash in midair, right, right. Or. Hold on, what does this do? Okay, I'd rather have that than... Than the hover thing, I guess. Might not even use it, but... Hover thing was screwing me up a little bit, so... I think we're good to go. I have a feeling that guy doesn't even die. Oh, he does. Why do I keep thinking enemies don't die? Oh, no. Take kind of tanky right now. Somehow I made it over that fireball. I'm not complaining. That was my only attempt at speed running. I got an HP back, then I lost it. Welcome to the story of my life. Probably shouldn't have dashed there. Oh, well. You live and you learn. Okay, okay. What is shooting fire? Okay. I figured it out. There's HP down in the fire. Could maybe pull off getting it. Oh yeah, that was real worth it. That wasn't even HP, was it? Oh well, hopefully I can spend some money to get HP, and I can. But we'll check out the shop first. Twelve max health plus one. Or sure, I'll just buy that. And don't need that. Don't need that. So then I will buy the re remainder of my HP back, which did not happen because the thing blew up. So I'll keep shoving money in here, complete all my funds, get all my m health back. I did the one rookie Megman mistake that I never forget. I'm giving you a chance to figure it out by yourself. Forgot to charge before entering the boss fight. Like the one thing you'd never forget to do. Oh, I tried to go under. Okay, it seems alright. I have a feeling this game either got. The bosses got a little bit easier, for one, and the levels might have got shorter. Oh, yeah, as I said, that I didn't realize that the, this boss has two phases. As far as I recall, this boss has not changed very much. I just forgot that there was a second phase. Timed it right, there we go. Okay, he's done for. What do we got? 1 HP, 2 HP, attack strength. Good to fucking go. Don't need another power up thing because I already forgot to get. I mean, forgot to use my other one. So let's go with the basic attack string. Check out what's in here. Health, that's all good with me. Some soul chips. And yeah, it does have like a rogue legacy style um, upgrade situation. Where I. Th also, I feel like. 
I didn't study enough to be talking about this, but from what I remember, this level sucks. No. Jesus, man, what the fuck is going on? It's with all the explosions, my dude. Calm down. Oh yeah, but from what I remember, um, you can either put money towards things that will, that you'll have on your next run you're trying to do, or you can put money into things that will unlock in the future. In the year 2000. In the year 2000. I'm a smart man for not going for the... Uh, the Andy high note there. Or wait, maybe it was the bomb, but... Anyways, I'm just getting in my own head now. Okay, let's see. How's this gonna work? It's fine. Get some more nuts. Don't need more energy. So that's fine. I mean, I should be using my power up more, possibly, but I'm getting by just fine. Well, that was a little bit dicey. Yep. Yeah, it was the bomb, but not Andy Richter that's saying the high part of in the year 2000. I'm assuming there's some kind of secret up here because it seems like a bitch to get up here. You can't. Well. Okay, let's do this. It's very interesting. Well, that's a secret if I ever did see one. I have no idea how I was going to get there without taking the leap of faith. And how the hell am I going to get down? That's a good question. Okay, that goes there, and that goes there, that goes here. Oh no! I was really hoping I would land on something. But I didn't. And I forgot that I have an air dash. Okay, can I look down? I cannot look down. Let's go right here. Oh god. Okay, don't panic. So don't forget you have an air dash. Ooh. Okay. Was that worth it? Probably. If I didn't fuck it up so bad. This is pretty much only a long Oh damn you. So this is only a long level because I'm making it long. Shouldn't have done that. I made it. This guy is being a real asshole right now. It's time for me to trade some HP for, I mean, trade some money for HP. Hopefully that opportunity comes up sooner rather than later. How am I going to do this? Okay. Um, let's go here and here. Let's shoot that dude. Dodge that. Get exploded. Get exploded. Yeah, my HP is really, really low, by the way. Not sure you noticed. Ooh, it only had to offer me one. Let's see what we can pull off. I'm not liking it, the looks of this dude. Eternal Star, you say. Hopefully, oh! Hopefully my air mobility gets me through this. I mean, my attacks are pretty strong, so that's always good. He doesn't seem to be taking very much damage right now. 
Let's get out of here. Oh god. Things are going awry. I I could have got out of that. But I didn't. Oh well. It was a good time. It was a good time. It was 23 minute 53 second time. Well, anyways, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time and I'll deposit my nuts into the bank. Anyways, have a good night. See you later.